Thank you. Peter Gabriel joins us this morning. It, it occurs to me that um, you've established a reputation for yourself that's going to be a little difficult to live up to. You are one of the real good guys in music, aren't you? Well, I don't think so. I mean, I think there's a few people now that are getting involved. And uh, um, yeah, there is a slight comeback now in that I think we're being branded as benefit whores, you know, available for any cause. And uh, um, I think it's very important, though, that musicians do stay with certain uh, causes. Perhaps it shouldn't be the same faces appearing at every event, and each person should find something that they feel strongly about and, and stick with it. Well, because every time you, you, you stick your head up and say, I do care about something and I'm available to help you, then every other worthy cause will want a piece of you. So how yeah. do you say no? Well, it's very hard. I mean, I think I probably have a over 250 requests in for the moment, and some of them are very important. But I took a lot of time over the last two years uh, on, on the various uh, projects that I was involved with, with the Human Rights Now and the Peace Concert. Um, and now I, I have to take some time for myself, and I'll probably get back into some of that work um, when I finish the next album. Well, I think you're allowed. Would you confirm a story I'd heard that you've done so many pro bono concerts that you're broke? Uh, no, I'm, I'm not broke, fortunately. Um, there's a situation where cash was a little tighter than anticipated, but um, uh, I think uh, it's fine. Good. Why don't we do some business? The sure. actual reason you are here today is because uh, uh, Peter Gabriel scored the controversial film The Last Temptation of Christ, which came out some time back. Only now, however, is the soundtrack released. It has a different name, Passion. In fact, it's rather different music than was the actual score of the film? Yeah, there were some pieces that weren't uh, included in the film. And after the film was finished, I listened to everything and started thinking, well, I'd really like to extend this and, and make this a part of this piece. And so um, I really want it now to stand up as a piece of work on its own, because I feel it's, you know, I put a lot of effort and it's got some of my best work in it. Why don't we look at some of the work? The work sure. we'll look at is that of a German artist. Stefan Roloff. Levels could you watch that on? Art, music, uh, spirituality, given that it, it went with the music, which you call intensely spiritual. So how many levels are there? Well, I think there's a lot of artists now, many fields who don't want to stay in the little boxes in which they sit. You know, I think there, were, there was a trend in the end of the 60s, the sort of multimedia uh, exploration. And I think that's coming back now in a big way. I mean, we're working on a sort of alternative theme park project at the moment with- Pardon? Yeah. Like an amusement park? That sort of thing, but trying to involve painters, psychologists, musicians, um, architects to design pathways of experience. And I think there's a lot of people now that I've talked to that seem very interested. And I'm sure we're going to see a lot more of that emerge and uh, in many areas where people from many different backgrounds are working together. You strike me as someone who doesn't have a muse. You have a team of horses. And they're, they're yeah. all clamoring inside your head uh, to, to, to find their own expression. How do, you, how do you divide your day? How do you know whether you're a music or a, yeah. you know? Well, I think with, with difficulty, I mean, uh, in some ways, I think I'm a jack of all trades. But I think uh, the decision making and the way you put things together um, is as important uh, as getting particularly skilled in, in any one of them. And so I think that's something I like doing and uh, very much enjoy collaborations with people from many fields. Well, thank you for letting us in for a few minutes. My pleasure. And we'll be back after this.